On uh, Jones, Matt, what is the significance of today's match with regard to his position? So lose, I think everyone agrees it's, it's all bets are off. Even the Australian Union will pull the plug. But even if they win today, is it over? It's a great question, Joe. Um, the, the, the big problem Australia's had is we keep blaming the head coach sure. for all the problems in Australian rugby. It was Michael Checker's fault. You know, then it's Dave Rennie's fault. Now, you know, now, now it's Eddie's fault. And then that means we're going to have a, if, if they get rid of Eddie, we've got another coach. Mm. There's no doubt Eddie's made a lot of mistakes. There's no doubt about that. His selections have been wrong. The way he's approached it hasn't been, it been a galvanising influence. It's been, oh, I'm going to solve the problems. We're, and then coming out, we're going to win everything. We're going to, and, mm. and, you know, we, you're one and six. And it makes you look very foolish and the team loses faith in you. So I think that I know they're going to do a strong review mm. and they'll make some decisions. Eddie might find, might say that his, his position is untenable in his own view. But either way, there is huge, huge damage done. Yeah. If he stays and can rebuild, well, that's great. That's great. But I'm, I'm not sure. I think he's going to have to change his style of leadership. He needs to unify the nation, not to come out and, and try and be the smart aleck. We, we need someone that's going to bring everyone together and say, we have got problems. The only way you're going to solve it is, uni is a unified approach. And uh, I, I'm just not sure that's in his personality. No. If I was Dave Rennie, I'd keep the phone on. <laughs> uh, it's a, what's happened to Dave is disgrace. For, he's done a great job. Decent guy. Should never happen. If they had to let Dave Rennie stay till the end of this World Cup and then brew in Eddie Jones, I think we have a totally different situation on our hands. Mm. But not only that, we've lost so many great assistant coaches from Dave Rennie's era have left the, the, the coaching ranks. Mm. Uh, you know, it's, it's, it was just a disastrous series of decisions. And that's what I'm saying. Yes, Eddie has responsibilities to blame. But it's so easy just to blame the boss of the national team. The problems are systemic. Australia under 18, 30, uh, lost to New Zealand under 18, 34-3. It is not just the team we're seeing on our screen now. It's mm. everything below it.